It has been 10 days now since criminals broke into the house of former Republican President Edgar Lungu in Ibex Hill and stole there in two television sets valued at 66,000 kwacha. Police had instituted some forensic investigations into the matter, which have now led to the arrest of Angel Chipasha, whom the police say is a member of the Patriotic Front Party PF. According to Inspector General of Police Lemi Kajoba, the suspect is among the PF members that have been frequenting the residence of the former heads of state and was arrested on Sunday, August 14, 2022, in 10 miles. The arrest of the suspect has led to the recovery of one television set, among the two which were stolen, and the police have launched a manhunt against another suspect, identified as Emmanuel Walia, who is believed to have sold the other television set. While the police claim that the suspect are PF cadres, the Patriotic Front think otherwise. Patriotic Front member of the Central Committee in Charge of Information and Publicity, Rafael Nakachinda, has accused the police of playing politics on this matter by linking the theft at former president's residence to some patriotic front cadres. What we know is that these can only be near to agencies within the establishment, not PF cadres. We are also undertaking our own investigation, following what the police are doing. And that's how come we are reacting sharply against the statement of Mr. Kajol in that regard, because he is playing politics. That he knows is playing politics. Remember that the UPND cadres, when that happened, what did they say? They said, no, those are PF you know, um, cadres that went to steal purely because the former president was supported together with his wife when they were summoned that day. They also have been harassing police officers at the, the former president's home, questioning them who deployed them to go and guard there. And even, you know, in a way, abandoning, saying you deployed yourself so you sort yourselves out. The whole idea, and this was orchestrated, maybe from at least a little inquiries, to try and get rid of those police officers because there is an assumption that they are loyal to the person of the former head of state. So that they can bring their own people at the residence of the former president with the hope that then those would be able now to start uh, maybe selling information. The first arrest has been made, but what many also are waiting to see is the outcome of the police investigations against the police officers who were on duty at the time the theft occurred. Jaras, Tonya, Jamo News.